Hi there, my name is Carrie. I'll be your RN today. Can you tell me your name and birth date? My name is Chris Johnson. My birth date is 5-18-70. Okay, great. That is you. Um, what brings you in today, Mr. Johnson? A sore upper left arm. Okay. Um, how long has that been happening? Six months now. Okay. Did you injure it or have a recent surgery on it? No, I injured it um, at work. Okay. I think just overuse. There was no particular point where I felt it. It just over time. Okay. What do you do for a living? I deliver beer. Okay. I drive a truck and deliver beer to stores, bars. Oh, okay. So you're lifting a lot of heavy things during the day, a lot of beer. Yeah, throughout the day, yes. How much weight do you think you lift per day? Uh, 15,000 pounds. Wow. Okay. And do you work five days a week or part-time? Five days, 45, 50 hours. Wow. All right. So you're lifting a lot um, during the week. Yes. Um, what is the, the, is it a certain motion um, that hurts or is it just even at rest? Uh, it's sore at rest, but when I have my arms above my head and lifting, grabbing cases or kegs, yeah, that's when I, the pain really okay. is felt. Um, what would you rate the pain? Zero being no pain, 10 being the absolute worst. Sometimes a seven or eight. Okay. And what about when you're at rest at home? Does it hurt? On occasion, yeah. Maybe a two or three. Okay. Soreness. Two. Two? Do you take anything for the pain? Uh, no, not usually. I've used those Bengays on my arm, though, um, a couple times throughout the last few months. Okay. When it's gotten bad. How many times do you think you've used it? Probably six. Okay. And does the pain radiate anywhere um, up your shoulder, into your neck, on your back? No. Okay. Um, and would you describe the pain when you're at work um, and it's, you know, you're, you're definitely moving it around? Um, would, you, uh, would you describe it as a sharp pain, ache? Um, sharp pain. Sharp pain? Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, um, let's talk about your... Um, health history a little bit. Um, do you uh, take any other medications regularly? No. Um, are, do you have any allergies? No. Do you smoke? No. Do you take any street drugs? No. Do you drink alcohol? Yes. Um, how many, how much do you think a week? Maybe 12. Is that mixed drinks or beer? Beer. Okay. And your childhood, um, did you have the normal childhood illnesses, chicken pox, measles? I had chicken pox. I did not have measles. Okay. What about scarlet fever or rheumatic fever? Neither one of those. Okay. Um, did you have your childhood vaccines? Yes. Okay. Um, what about as an adult? Have you received the flu vaccine? Yes, I have. Um, how, for how many years do you think you've been having that? I believe the last 10 years I've gotten it every year. Okay, great. Um, let's see here. Uh, medical history. Do you have any um, health history, health problems? Um, I was hospitalized uh, quite some time ago for colitis uh, in the late 90s, 98, 99. Okay. So twice it happened and they were a year apart. All right. And um, what did they do for you at the hospital? Um, I think I got antibiotics and fluids and was on a clear liquid diet. Okay. Did they give you steroids while you were there for that? Yes. Okay. And have you had any flare-ups from the colitis since? No. Okay. Um, how about sexually transmitted diseases or HIV? No. No. Okay. Um, any surgeries? No. Um, how about psychiatric history? No. Okay. All right, and let's move on to your family history. Are your parents currently alive? Yes. How old is your, your father? 72. Okay, and how about any significant health history there? He is currently battling prostate cancer. Okay, um, any cardiac issues? No. All right, and how about your mom? Is she alive? Yes, she's also 72. And any health history with her? A year, year and a half ago, she battled and um, cancer of the bladder. Okay. And is doing fine. 
Great. Good to hear. Um, what about um, any uh, cardiac history with your mom? No. No? Okay. Um, and any siblings? I have two older brothers. Okay. Are they both alive? Yes. How old is your oldest brother? Fifty. Any significant health history with your oldest brother? Um, he battles depression, anxiety, um, alcoholism, and uh, okay. Yeah. And what about the middle brother? Um, How old is he? He's forty-nine. Okay. Any health history with him? Uh, he's been battling MS since he's been 20. Okay. And are you married? Yes. Um, how old is your wife? 42. Has she experienced any health history or health um, problems? No. Okay. And do you have children? Yes. What are their ages? 20 and 8. Nine. <laughs> I just turned nine. Okay. All right. Your oldest son, um, does he have any significant health history? Yes. What does he have? Depression. Depression? Yeah. Okay. Has he ever attempted suicide? Yes, twice. Okay. And anything else with him? No. Okay. And uh, what about your youngest son? Any health history with him? No. All right. Okay, um, where were you born, Mr. Johnson? In Livonia, Michigan. Okay, and did you finish high school? Yes. All right, and did you go to college? Yes. And what age were you married? 25. Okay, and when you um, first got married, uh, what was your, um, your job? in a fabrication shop. Okay, what did you make? Lab countertops for science rooms. Okay, and did you have children during that time? Yes. Okay, and when did you start working as a truck driver? 98. Okay, um, what about any emotional stress or financial stress? Has that been a part of your um, history? Just the normal stuff, yes. Okay. Um, anything with your son's suicide attempts? Um, was that uh, anything emotionally traumatic for you? Have you received sure. any counseling for that? Yes. Okay. Um, who do you have you seen a professional counselor for that? No. Who do you um, rely on to talk to? My wife. Okay. All right. And how about um, hobbies or out of work interests? What do you like to do? Watch sports, coach. What do you coach? Soccer. Okay. And how long have you been doing that? On and off for 15 years. Okay, great. Um, and what about religious preferences? Do you, go, do you attend church? No. Okay. Let's talk about your typical day. What um, Monday through Friday, what time do you usually wake up? Four. And what time do you usually go to bed? 8.30. Okay, and can you sleep through the night usually? Yes. And what about on the weekend? What time do you usually wake up? Um, Seven-ish. Okay, and what time do you usually fall asleep? 9.30. Okay, and when you eat dinner, is it by yourself, you, or any of your meals really, is it usually with your by yourself or with your family? With my family in the evening. Okay. Obviously and, when I'm at work by myself. All right. And fast food, do you, would you say fast food is a large part of your diet? No. No? Okay. All right. Um, what about when you're um, at work or driving? Do you wear your seatbelt? Yes. Okay. And how about sunscreen? Do you wear sunscreen? No. All right. And do you keep your medicines locked or unlocked in, the, in a medicine cabinet? Unlocked. Okay. And what about cleaning solutions? Are they locked or unlocked? Unlocked. Okay. Um, do you have a gun at home? No. All right. Um, 
for uh, weight issues. Um, have you noticed that you've gained any weight or lost any weight in the last few years? I've gained weight in the last few years. And how much do you think? Uh, roughly 10, 15 pounds. Okay, and where have you um, gained that? Has it been all over or just in one certain area of your body? Just in my stomach, gut. Okay. Any rashes or lesions? No. Okay. Have you ever had head, head injury? No. How about your eyes? Um, do you wear glasses? No. Have you ever had blur vision, double vision? No. Um, excessive tearing or pain in your eyes? No. How about um, hearing? Do you have any issues with hearing? What? Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um, how about vertigo or ear infections? No. All right. Um, your nose. Um, any issues with your nose and breathing? Yes. What, what, what's going on? I have a deviated septum. Okay. Does that affect your breathing? Yes. How so? I snore at night, I suppose. Um, well, I eat. Sometimes I have to eat with my mouth open so I can breathe. Okay. All right. Um, have you ever had surgery for a deviated septum? No. Okay. Um, typically during the year, do you suffer um, from excessive colds or flus? No. Okay. All right. Um, and you do not have any allergies. Does that include seasonal allergies? Correct. Okay. And when's the last time that you've been um, to the dentist? Uh, nine months ago. Okay. And any significant dental history? Any root canals, missing teeth? Yeah, I've had three root canals, I believe. Okay. And what about your gums? Do they bleed when you brush them? No. Okay. How many times do you brush your teeth? Twice a day. And do you floss? No. Okay. Do you know what um, like swollen glands are? Have you ever noticed that or had a doctor tell you that you suffer from swollen glands or you have a goiter in your no. neck? No. Any pain in your neck? No. Okay. And this is going to be a strange one. Um, your breasts, have you ever noticed any unusual growth or discharge? No. Okay. Um, how about respiratory? Uh, do you excessive coughing, wheezing? No. Um, how many pillows do you sleep with usually at night? Two or three. Okay. Some people with respiratory issues will sleep with more pillows. That's why I ask. Oh. Um, how about heart history? Um, anyone ever tell you you have high blood pressure? No. Okay. Um, any chest pain, palpitations, fast heart rate? No. Have you ever had an ECG? It's where they stick the little stickers up to your chest and uh, record your heart waves? No. Okay. All right. Since your colitis, how has your ap appetite been? Good. Any nausea, vomiting, cramping? No. Okay. Um, let's talk about your bowel movements, everybody's favorite subject. Do you have any issues with um, uh, going to the bathroom? No. Any um, bleeding from your rectum, any hemorrhoids? No. Okay. Gallbladder, liver problems? No. And would you describe um, your bowel movements as loose, um, f fatty looking, Firm, formed? Firmed, formed. <laughs> okay. And how about urination? Do you ever have, have problems urinating? No. No? Any blood in your urine? No. No? Do you get up at all during the night to use the bathroom? No. And how about where, your kidneys? Do you ever have kidney pain or kidney infections? No. Okay. Um, and you said you didn't have any type of sexually transmitted diseases, correct? Correct. Um, any uh, infections of the penis? Any discharge? No. Okay. Um, let's talk about your legs um, and arms. Um, do you know what varicose veins are? Yes. Do you have those? No. Okay. Any swelling in your legs or your hands? No. Any pain besides that left arm? No. Okay. All right. And you said that you didn't have any psychiatric history, correct? And have you ever suffered from fainting spells? No. Seizures, headaches? No. Have you ever lost your memory? No. Okay. And any um, blood disorders? Have you ever experienced just um, bleeding easily or um, uh, bruising easily? No. Okay. All right. Anything else that you'd like to talk to me about? No. Okay. Um, any other concerns or questions before we start the physical history, physical assessment? No. Okay. 
All right, well thank you so much Mr. Johnson. Um, I'm going to leave you some scrub pants. Um, when I leave the room, feel free to get um, in those and then I'll be back to do the physical assessment. Okay. All right, thank you.